There it is. It's two. Hey guys, welcome back. We're here to going to talk to you about ground reaction force and how you can improve it, right? Biggest issue for pitchers is that they get right here, everyone looks good, but as we start down, we really drive on it and we push and create that ground reaction force. But by the time we land, we're coasting into our landing. And obviously we know that that is not uh, what we're trying to accomplish. If you really drive here, but coast into your landing, a lot of times we get front side um, whip or, or, or rotation too early or get top heavy, right? We need a uniform push through heel strike. So let's get JT right here and we're just gonna work this, all right? So watch when he does this incorrectly and he coasts into foot strike. It's almost like a, a springing or a coiling and then it springs forward and just releases all the energy here rather than when we need it at the foot strike. Go ahead. And you can kind of see, obviously the feedback here is tremendous, right? Uh, you feel here, here. <laughs> you really can't do it, right? So guys who have this issue, who really expand all of the energy right here or maybe right here, will have big sensory overloads with our, our bungees. But if you do it right, so do it wrong one more time. Okay, you can see the back foot is flailing and causing a lot of jerk and pull. Now do it correct, right? I need you to push through foot strike and you'll be a lot better here. Push through foot strike. Okay, not too bad. Still a little coast, correct? Right? So this also identifies that you probably have too long of a, of a um, stride right now. So shorten your stride so you can push longer through heel strike. There it is. You obviously saw the plane get a lot better. Check out our other videos for more tips about how to use the harness. Oh boy.